Hey, welcome back to Sales Made Easy podcast. My email is tom at salesmadeeasy.com. Any information, any data, you'll get some of our giveaways if you email me and get our email list and my newsletter list. Uh, we're just creating a one on prospecting, a great little tool to help you with prospecting. So feel, feel free to email me, Tom at Sales Made Easy, or connect through the LinkedIn button, or connect through YouTube, one of the two, or three, or four. But that's the interesting thing. Today I'm going to talk about, actually this month I'm going to talk about the, the number three, three steps. We're going to talk about the three-foot rule. We're going to talk about the power of three. And we're going to talk today about taking three steps back. Because we know the whole goal, you know, if, if you stay with it, is to make more money, but not make through money through making sales, make through more money through making customers, right? And too often we're so headstrong on trying to make sale that we're not thinking about making a customer or a relationship. Now, I always joke about people that say they're in a relationship business. These are the same people that say, I'm in a relationship business, and they give about 10 quotes out and get one back saying, you got this deal. I got to be honest with you, that's a terrible relationship. I mean, I do have people that'll tell me no all day long, but, and it's a relationship, but it's not really what I consider I want to live for. I want to live for that I'm in the rapport building or customer building or consultative building relationship, not the relationship relationship. So here's what I want you to think about. This is the three steps back rule and very simple. Every time you get a little stomach crunch, you feel like it's stalled out a little, you feel like it's not moving like it should be, I want you to take three steps back. Think about the sales process that you're going through. You might be in the quoting or the demo section and um, you're doing a demo and it doesn't feel right, right? They're just not asking the right questions or what have you. What do we typically do? We try to push harder through that demo. We try to keep it going, keep it alive. Well, what I want you to do is take three steps back. Realize that, hey, maybe you don't have rapport. Maybe you didn't ask the right questions in the discovery meeting. Maybe you didn't set the whole demo up correctly. There's a lot of whole maybes. But instead of moving forward, take one, two, and three steps back. And that could be as simple as, you know, I get the feeling the demo we're doing isn't hitting the mark. And it's probably my fault. I probably didn't ask enough questions as to what really would make this demo worthwhile for you. Can we back up for a minute? Can I ask you a few questions before we continue about what you're really looking for? Too often we're scared to back up. And I want you to take the three steps back from now on whenever you feel it's stalling out instead of keep pushing forward. Take three steps back. Hey, let me take a step back. I don't feel we're at the stage yet to go ahead and uh, move forward with the demo. And here, let me tell you why. What you've just done there is you've created a relationship of more a consultative type as opposed to, hey, can I give you a quote? So rule is, if you feel it in your stomach that things aren't smooth, if the prospect's not asking the right questions or saying the right things. If you don't feel whatever you're at is going the way you should, don't be afraid to go backwards. Hey, you know what? Maybe I'm moving too fast. Let me back up for a minute and ask you some more questions. That'll make sure you have a stronger rapport, look totally different as opposed to the typical salespeople that keeps pushing it through. So that's the simple rule for today. Take three steps back whenever you feel things are slowed down, a little bump in the road, whatever. Back up. It won't hurt you. It will help you. Stop being so scared to back up that you keep pushing forward and lose any relationship whatsoever. So that's it for today. Take a look. Email me if you want my new prospecting tool, um, tom at salesmadeeasy.com, and or click on the YouTube subscription and or just click on LinkedIn or Facebook and say you want it. I'm more than happy to send it to you. Till next time, have sales and make them easy.